Welcome to this tutorial, where we'll explore two practical methods for concatenating cells in Excel based on specific conditions. The first method utilizes a formula incorporating the IF function, while the second method employs VBA code for a more automated approach. Let's delve into the intricacies of each method and enhance your proficiency in Excel concatenation. Let's start with the first method, utilizing a formula based on the IF function to concatenate cells when a specific condition is met. Assuming that you have a list of data in range A1, B6, you wish to concatenate cells in column B if the approatiate cell values are same in the column A. You can use a method based on formulas and filter function to concatenate cells in range B1, B6 based on the cell values in range A1, A6 if they are same, you can use two formulas based on the IF function and the concatenate function. Select one blank cell, cell C2, beside range B1, B6, and then type the formula, equals IF, A2 less than greater than A1, B2, C1 and, and B2. Press Enter key on your keyboard to apply it. Drag the autofill handle in cell C2 down to other cells to apply this formula. You need to type another formula in cell D2, type equals if A2 less than greater than A3, concatenate A2, C2. Then press Enter key. Drag the autofill handle in cell D2 down to other cells to apply this formula. You would see that the cell values in range B1, B6 have been concatenated in range D1 laughing face 6. Now you need to filter out all blank cells in range D1 laughing face 6. And select all cell in range D1 laughing face 6. Go to Data tab, click Filter button under Sort and Filter group. And a filter array icon will be added in the first cell in range D1 laughing face 6. Click the filter icon in cell D1, and uncheck blanks checkbox, and then click OK button. Now, let's shift our focus to the second method, where we'll employ VBA code to automate the concatenation process. Press Alt plus F11 to open the Visual Basic for Applications editor within Excel. Click Insert and choose Module to create a new module. Copy and paste the following VBA code. This VBA macro will compare cell values in column A and then concatenate cell values in column B and pass the concatenated values into column C and started from cell C2. Then clicking Save button. Back to the current worksheet, click on Macros button under Code Group. Select Concatenate Cells if Same Value Exists Macro. Then click Run button. You can see that the VBA code automates the concatenation process based on the specified condition. This method is particularly useful for larger datasets and offers a more streamlined approach to concatenation in Excel. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial on efficiently concatenating cells in Excel using both a dynamic formula and VBA code insightful, don't forget to subscribe for more Excel tips and tricks. The interplay between the formula method and VBA code provides you with versatile tools for your data manipulation needs. Stay tuned for additional tutorials, and feel free to explore these methods in your Excel projects.